Now we're going to edit our keyboard chords for the project. So scroll along to keyboard and select down in the bottom left there, smart piano. Now we have a range of chord strips here and we need to edit those so that they're only showing the ones that we need for our project. So up in the top right hand corner, tap the settings cog. Halfway down, you will see edit chords, select that. And now we're going to select each chord strip in turn and set it to the chord that we need for the project. So if you tap on the very first chord strip, E minor, and then scroll these columns at the top so that the first column is C, the second is Mage, short for major, and the third and fourth columns are none. Once you've done that, tap the second strip, scroll this one to F, Mage, None, None. Tap the third chord strip and scroll to G, Mage, and then we want the number seven and None in the fourth column. Now, all the rest of the chord strips, we want to get rid of those. So we're going to tap them one at a time, scroll to none in the first column, and then the other columns will default to none and your chord will disappear. So we'll just go across all the remaining chord strips, scrolling to none in the first column. So once your chord strips match this view here with C, F, G7, and then blank, you can go up to the top right hand corner and tap done. And you should have this view ready to record your first section.